Okay, welcome back. In order to view the data from the table of the database, we need to use SQL select statement. This is the first part of the tutorial. In the second part of the tutorial, we'll study how to modify, add or delete the columns in an existing table. This can be done with the help of SQL's alter statement. Now, in case you are here for the first time, this is Cute Therapy and today we will study select and alter statements in SQL. Now the syntax of the select statement is select columns according to your choice according to the condition from table name. Now select and from are the keywords and hence are mentioned in red. Now let's have some hands on and go to SQL Server 2012. In the previous tutorial, we had already created a table named football. It had three columns that is serial number, player name and total wealth. And we had inserted some data into them. Let's select star from football. Execute. Now we see that there are three columns and in these three columns there are some there is a data of some famous footballers. This data again might not be correct according to facts and figures. This is the total wealth. Now we will use how to view data in certain conditions now in the first step we have used till now select star from football and when we execute it the whole content of the table is viewed at the bottom now select star refers to all the records present in the table star refers to all the contents of the table now let's say that we want to select a particular column of the table and we want to view only the contents of that particular column of the table now for instance in this table i want to view just the player names only the player names i want to view then i'll write select the column name that is player name from the table name is football i select the query and execute it. It says invalid. It was P name, I guess. The name of the column was P name. The column name was player name only. Uh, we had verified it by using select star from football. Now let us select only the player name column that is select player underscore name from football I select the query and execute it I see that all the contents of the uh, column player name can be listed can be viewed at the bottom that is when Rooney is at Neymar Cristiano Ronaldo and Lionel Messi now it can be brought into special reference that let's say let's select star from football and we see that the order in which the table is listed is serial number first player name second and total wealth third i just want to see the total wealth and the player name columns in in a particular order that is i want the total wealth to be displayed at the first place and the player name to be placed at the second uh, second place in the created view so I just change the order that is first I'll write total underscore wealth comma player underscore name from football select the query and execute it we can see that the generated view has the listed of the table as we have mentioned the order of the columns in which we wanted to view now this is how a different view can be generated based upon the need now there might be some scenario in which we want to uh, we want to view the table according to a particular order only let's say that the total let's see the what the total contents were the total contents were uh, serial number, player name and total wealth. I want to view the table 
in order of descending order of serial number that is 1 2 3 4 5 is listed in ascending order i want to see the table in a descending order then at i'll write as select star from table name and i will use order by clause that is order by and give the column which refers to order by that is in this particular table i want that the table should be listed according to sno column and that too in descending order for writing the descending order we need to use the keyword desc that is descending now select it and execute we see that the data has come in a descending order that as per serial number that is 54321 has been listed as per the executed query which is correct now again if i want to see the data in an ascending order i just need to change it here i just will write asc that is ascending and will execute the query again the listing of the table comes according to serial number now you might wonder that here only numeric values are there so the listing is being done based upon numbers only but this is not the case the listing can be done based upon other columns for instance player name column can also it, it can also be done based upon player name column but here the listing will be done based upon alphabetical order that is a to z if i write asc that means i am searching for the player names in ascending order when i execute the query we see that cristiano ronaldo c starting with c then lionel messi starting with l neymar n wayne w and z the order in which the table is, table contents are listed is in alphabetical ascending order similarly if i write it as d e s c then the contents will be viewed in descending order as per the player name column yeah that is correct now this is the order by clause guys and uh, in there might be some scenario in which we just want to see only the few rows that are present at the top of the table in order to do that write select top let's say 3 i want to view just the top 3 rows top 3 rows of table that is select top 3 star from football when i select it and execute it we i see that top 3 rows of the table which have been defined earlier are only displayed if i want to see only the top three footballers listed in the table select the top three only a particular column i want to see just a particular column for example i want to see total underscore wealth from football I select it and execute it i see that only the column named total wealth is displayed whereas in the previous case since i had marked star all the contents of the table had been displayed now this is uh, the select statement and for learning about alter statement we need to see the syntax alter statement is used to basically add modify or delete columns in an existing table now the syntax for adding a column is alter table table name add column name and the data type of the column now i'll write alter table the name of the table is football add column let us say i want to add a column named the country to which the player belongs country and the data type is where care that is uh, of 50 length add column okay i don't need to write the keyword column i just need to mention the column i need to add that is country 
I select it and I execute it. We see that the command ran successfully. Let us select star from table. Let us select star from football. And execute it. We see a fourth column has been added named country which has no values, which has null values at present since we have not updated, since we have not put in any country name in the existing table. Hence, the data appears at null. Now, in this second part, if we want to alter the table by, by altering the content of the table, now we see that the data type of serial number is int, player name is varchar. We can verify it by going to the table at your left hand side that is football go to select table as create to and new query the original query the original uh, table in which the serial number is int player name is varchar total wealth is int and country is varchar again so i just i just want to change the data type of the uh, column present in the original table what I'll write is alter, we'll use the alter table, alter table query that is alter table the name of the table that is full football alter column the name of the column let's say I want to change the data type of player underscore name from where care to n care n care 50 i select the query and execute it um an error is being changed oh i have used a correct incorrect pattern for the same let's execute this again the command ran successfully let's select start from table and we see the player names have been listed now go to the original definition of table we see that the total the player name data type has been changed to ncare hence by executing this query we have changed the data type of the existing column in the table now there might be some scenario in which we want to drop a column, in which we want to delete a column from a, the table. In that case, we will use the keyword drop and this will be done with the help of alter statement itself. The syntax is alter table, table name, drop column and the name of the column. That is alter table, football, the name table football drop column drop let us say I want to drop the column named country country the executed the highlighted query is executed the command ran successfully let's select star from table that is the in after display the fourth column has been deleted Thank you so much for watching this video guys. Like and subscribe my channel for more. Thank you.